What's up everybody? Welcome back to Barnes Box. We got the final unboxing for now <laughs> um, of launch stuff for the Series X. This time we have 13. So this one isn't uh I don't believe enhanced for the Series X, but it will obviously run on it through back compat. Not even it's not 4K, but it does have HDR, which I was not expecting, which might look really nice on this kind of cell shaded game. Um we'll find out. Uh yeah, it's not. Just got HDR. It will obviously run on X, but not with any kind of uh, optimizations. But you know, you'll get faster load times and that kind of thing. So the limited edition, we get collector metal case, which I'm a little bit nervous is going to be a metal pack, especially based on that picture. But we'll see. I can't really three lithograph, three lithographs, and 13 golden weapons in pack. Player's 13, a man without an identity. Solo campaign with numerous twists and turns. I never actually played this uh, originally. This is obviously a remaster of a game on... I think it came out on PS2 and the original Xbox. My little brother had it. Um, and I watched him play it a little bit. And it looked pretty cool. I just never... Self. Pop this out here. Already not looking good. The fact that I can see teams on both sides. Yep. We got a metal pack, boys. It does have the title on the spine, so I mean, credit where credit is due, but unfortunately, it is a metal pack, not a steelbook. I personally am not a fan of these things. They never really line up right here. You probably see that, how it's not like lined up properly. Lined as well as a steelbook. Got these ugly ass hinges. Um, but, I mean, nice enough steel uh, metal pack either way. Uh, and I'm not sure what the character, so I'm guessing that's 13. I think that's his name, isn't it? On the back, that person is. We got perforation on it. We do. All right. So, um, I'll show the one benefit of a metal pack in a minute, but for now, we've got lithographs. Guns and knives and crossbow and ooh. We've actually got stuff in the back here. 13 has a formidable arsenal. Each weapon can be used normally or in alternated fire mode. Knife. Knife, I guess. United States. The president's been assassinated. Dun dun. Main character, General Carrington. That reminds me of uh, Carrington from Perfect Dark. Uh, Jones, Amos, the Mongoose, the One. Yep, code for the skin pack, which comes with Kind of generic gold skins at this point. Not really all that original, let's be honest. Got the disc. So inside we've got the, the kind of comic booky look. Bow, pow, extra. But here's the one benefit of a metal pack. Because the spine hinges like this, it does mean it can fold out into one scene. Focus. Which, in some games it works out. Batman Arkham Origins, this one, I, two individual pictures. Even the X just cuts out right here. Not like a unified picture like some metal packs are having. So overall, pretty disappointing metal pack. Uh, if you're gonna do a metal pack, at least do a metal pack. This could easily be in a steel book. Credit where credit's due for the title on the spine though. And these uh lithographs are actually pretty cool with this uh information on the back, actually. Pretty impressed with that. Um and then the gold skin that I'll read later before this goes out. Um yeah, that, that's it. That's uh, the 13 limited edition. Let me know in the comments if you pick this game up. Um, uh, like I said, it's not optimized for Series X, but it did come out today on the launch of the system, which seems a bit suicidal. There we go. Uh, and yeah, let me give me that thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Hit that subscribe button if you want to see some more content. Hit that bell wherever it may be if you want to know when any of that stuff goes live immediately and be one of the first people to watch it. Um, find a food in some of my videos who knows um 
yeah, I hope to see you all next time. I'm not sure what we'll be doing next. Maybe some Series X footage of stuff, or maybe I don't think I have any. I have some unboxings that I recorded and failed. Uh, the settings were all wrong, and it came out horrible to the point where I don't want to. I might repackage some of that stuff and do kind of fake unboxings where I've always opened it. We'll see. Anyway, um, I'll quit rambling. I hope you guys are all enjoying your day. Hopefully you're enjoying whatever gaming you may be doing. Hey, next gen, current gen, or last gen, current gen, whatever you want to call them. And I will see you next time.